Welcome back. Please. Thank you, Wally. Hey, guys. I used to be a Bieber skeptic. And then I saw his face, and now I'm a believer. <laughs> It's been seven years since Justin Bieber was plucked from YouTube and thrust onto the world stage. And despite some controversies and a fair whack of haters, the Biebs is bigger today than he's ever been. What do you mean? Justin, welcome back to Australia. Thanks for having me. Now, congratulations, what do you mean? Thank you. Well, number one, it's awesome. Thank you. Uh, you. Did you know it was going to be like number one? Did you know it was going to be this big? I didn't know how big it was going to be, no. It was uh, it was definitely a surprise to me. Yeah? I mean, sure, you must have an idea. Like, did you, did you, even then, you had, did you, did you try to predict? Did you when try I to heard go... the song, I loved, I mean, immediately fell in love with it. So I knew people were going to fall in love with it the way I did, hopefully. What do you mean? And what do you mean is basically about not knowing what ladies are going on about now. Man to man, fella to fella. Yeah. Why can't they just be straight with this man? I don't know, dude. Why are they always playing with us all what? the time, right? What advice would you give? You know, future Mrs. Bieber, what would you say? Just if you could just put a message out into the ether. I'd just say, um, what do you mean? <laughs> just listen to the song. <laughs> and there's a good chance she has. With a song topping the charts all around the world, even claiming Justin his first US number one after he debuted the song with an emotional performance at the VMAs. How are you feeling just the moment before you go out on stage? Because I imagine there's pressure from the millions watching around the world, but the industry in the room, like who are you seeing in the audience? Um, Kanye and like <laughs> Kardashians and stuff like that. And it was cool, they, they were loving the performance. And um, yeah, everyone was really, proud of me and that really felt good because I worked really hard at it. The video, speaking about becoming a man, that's pretty racy. It's pretty steamy. Is it, is it racy? I, I got a little bit. You got a half. Look at him, you, got, you just blushed, dude. I'm blushing. I've got this bit of paper. <laughs> With a legion of believers around the world, Justin's online following is massive dominating Twitter and Facebook. And on YouTube, where it all began, he has racked up a staggering 6.1 billion views. And social media is massive for you. 67 million Twitter followers. Yep. Do you know how much the president has? How many? 64. Really? Yeah. 64? You're more famous than the president. Dang. Are you gonna run? Maybe. I think Kanye's running now. If you could go back and, 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 and chat to younger Justin, what, what a bit of advice would you, would you give him? Would you have a time machine at the back? I would just say, like, listen. Yeah? Yeah. Instead of just learning the hard way, just learn the easy way. It's a lot easier. People yeah. aren't saying stuff just to say stuff. People, when they're trying to help you. I just wasn't listening. If I was your boyfriend. With millions of fans desperate to meet him, Justin says they can get a little overwhelmed face to face. Sometimes they miss the moment. I'm like, they're, they're like, I don't know. It's like they're one moment to see me, so they kind of just don't know what to do or just what to say, and I, it's understandable. But sometimes I'm a guy like, hey, hey, relax, one second. Hey, I'm right here. I can talk to you. We can have a conversation. And I would way rather have that moment and then be able to snap out of it and be able to understand that like I'm, I'm human and I'm easy to talk to. I mean, I've seen a lot of the, the interview, interviews today with the girls out in the street and I would be concerned that they would not be able to contain themselves. Really? Yeah. I mean, when you tap me on the knee, I was, well, you know... Well, yeah. 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 Let's not get into that. Now, I've been, uh, I've been using your Instagram for inspiration for my summer body. Yeah? Yeah. What... <laughs> What are you laughing, man? <laughs> it's not, it's just funny. Summer bodies are made in winter. I've heard that. Have you heard that? No, I heard the dad bods in though, so you're you're right on top. <laughs> I got the dad bod. Um, which filter should I use to make this look a little bit more like that? Um, Mayfair. Mayfair. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Man, it's been really fun having a chat with you. Welcome back to Australia, and uh, and good luck with everything, man. 